Saints at the Steelers. Steelers plus three right now. I know. What do we do here, though? Because we don't even know who the Saints quarterback is. So I don't think it matters. I, think I wanted a- to take Andy Dalton. If it's not, I'm, I'm, we're all learning pretty quickly here. If it's not prime time, you take Andy. If it's a prime time game, God forbid, do not take Andy Dalton. I, I, how do I keep doing? I keep not seeing these stats about him melting down the prime time. As soon as the game starts, action will tweet it out. It's like, yeah, he's six and sixteen in prime time games. It's like, geez, just let that money on fire. Uh, he fucking sucks, Andy Dalton. Um, I don't know what to do here. Every every ounce of my body wants me to take the Saints. They're the better team. They're the more complete team. We've seen Pittsburgh. They've been a seller. They were a seller at the deadline, but not even that. I just they have their offense has no identity. Like they just have nothing there. Where the Saints, I know exactly who they are and what they are. So I don't know. I'll, I'll I'll probably pass on this one for right now, but I'm I'm leaning towards the Saints. I I just think they're the better team. Feels like a Mike Tomlin rah rah to me. Yeah, it probably is. It's like. The Steelers had a bye. Uh, the Saints have a short week, a home dog. Like, if you're going to get right and rally the troops around the guys in the locker room, <laughs> give Kenny Pickett, you know, an extra week to learn. Yeah. The Saints coming off a really devastating loss. Um, that feels to me like you're tanking the Steelers here. And by the way, you're hoping to get them at three and not have it go to two and a half because the money's coming in on the, on the Steelers right now and the line is moving. 